about to see is was shot over the summer in Kitchener. Andy and I were lucky enough, we ended up going to Kitchener with uh, John from Infinity Goalie. Got to test out their new line of goalie gear. I've been a day one supporter of Infinity because I like the people behind it. John's obviously the one behind it, as you'll see in the video. Also a big fan because it's Canadian made. I love Canadian made stuff. I like to support the economy. That's just my personal beliefs. As far as the equipment goes, it was a little bit of an adjustment period getting used to it. It's a lot different from what uh, I'm typically used to with equipment, but any, any equipment you're gonna try is gonna be an adjusting period. Whether you're using Vaughn to Bauer, or Bauer to Warrior, or Warrior to Brian's, Brian's to Infinity, whatever the case may be. A lot of people expect that they're gonna hop in their equipment day one, they're gonna love it. Chances are you're probably not gonna love it day one. If you have an opportunity, go to a demo day, try out some new gear. The most realistic environment setting you're gonna get to be able to try this gear on. Infinity's got something really nice. You can actually demo a full set of pads anywhere in the world. They'll ship you a set of pads, you give them a full deposit, they'll give you your money back once you return the equipment. It's a great overall experience. I think it's really cutting edge because nobody else in the industry does that. And again, thank you, John, for having us out this summer. Enjoy the video. So it's the first ice time I'm gonna have since I hurt my collarbone. It's not a broken collarbone. It's just a really, really bad bruise. I had to wear my sling for a couple days. So testing out the Infinity stuff. So it should be a fun, exciting day today. I like the uh, landing gear you got like down here, like the support. You wanna try some uh, shots on the knees? I feel like right off the bat, like, the knee stacks are like, like a little short, kinda. Short as in this way? Yeah. Okay. No, I play with a pretty normal, like, narrow butterfly as is. I, I like it a bit longer, yeah. I'll come off my post, butterfly, and then slide in for a shot. I like the stiffness, like, I love the nice stiff pads. Like These are actually, this is the stiffest that we go. Like that's, so you know I said there's medium stiff and, uh, and uh, soft, that's, that's stiff. I like a little bit of a single break, because that way when I narrow things up, it'll kind of like tuck in just a wee bit more. I can just narrow butterfly and it stays in my knee stack so I can cover that up. So like I'll, I'll start here or whatever, butterfly. I'll push back to my post. I'll make the read you over there and then just transition off that, that post. Yeah, just kind of in tight. Like I'll work the cuff a bit, work a little bit of the, the pad flex. Butterfly, recover to my post, make the reader there and then. Oh, yeah, I got it. Okay. I heard the Second, it was like that, so then the second you moved, it went up on top. Yep. But if you keep it in this loop here, it can't go up top because it's stuck, right?
video is of? It's not. But while I got you here, don't exit out of the video yet. You might as well go to sidelineswap.com. I'm gonna save you the sales pitch. I've been selling you on this stuff for about two years now. I'm running out of ideas. What I need you to do is go to the website because they got some smoking deals, which I completely get overpaid to endorse, but hey, that's besides the point. Go to the website and I will see you next week.